What's up guys, this is Mr. Renzo Kuzmi, and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man X. So in our last episode I took down the Mavericks, and time to go to our second to last one, Flux Space. And something new, I got a, I actually got a controller, and I'm just testing it out. It's a Gigaware PC controller, it's just like PC controller, and to test it out for this video and see how it works out. For this segment, you just want to like rush through it because there's lasers. I wouldn't recommend rushing through it, but yeah, depending on how well it plays the game. This controller is kind of working out for me. When I test recorded this and I was trying to get used to the controller, I was actually sucking pretty bad. I'm so used to the keyboard for je dash jumping and all that. Now I have a controller. This makes somewhat life easier. And I was testing it for the other X Games too. And it worked out pretty good. So I guess I'm doing the X series then. Maybe I might come to the Mega Man series. I do not know. Ooh. Yeah, this whole level is just like a vertical tower scaling level. I don't know what the hell I was saying. Ah. I'm getting the feeling you can't hear the game, the game volume, because I can't hear it either. Um, not. Ooh. Once I get to this next segment, I'm gonna. All right, I'll be right back. I'm gonna turn up the game volume. All right. I hope you can hear it now. Alright, to get that heart tank. I might kill this guy first, but get this heart tank. Oh that outside. Anyway. <laughs> okay, to get this heart tank, you have to have shotgun eyes, charge it all the way up, and then climb on this. And then dash jump. Or dash whatever. And I think that should be the last heart tank. I haven't played Mega Man X in like so long, I don't remember. I don't remember where that last sub tank is. I've been just doing research. Well, not really research, research, but just. But that'd be unfair and be accounting for cheating. I want to make it somewhat legit. Nope. You gonna move. No, nigga! Ah! It's not gonna move! Uh, open energy. Okay. Man, and I think our next our Maverick is weak against the Nicole. God, I already forgot these niggas' names. You really want to actually remember with Spark Mandro, Armor Armadello, Launch Octopus, Pink Chameleon, Flame Mammoth. It's because their names are so odd. It's like that. It, they could have just stuck it with like classic Mega Man. Just like. Really. It's like something man. But no. They have like these confusing names. Oh god. Yeah, you don't want to let them touch you. Because they'll fuck you off the raw. I think he'll throw his like pointers at you. Mm. Me? I've never actually seen all the weapons charged up. 
い Never mind. All right. Well. Oh wait, I lied. There's one more heart tank. I just remembered. But besides that, we get boomerang cutter. Fires a bunch of boomerangs. <laughs> Screw you, password screen! Alright, time to check on the last Maverick. Sting Chameleon. That's a long robotic tongue. No homo. For some reason, this background cut reminds me of Woodman stage. Even though he was like a hard fucking boss. Ah! Alright, um. I don't know something else. Is. Okay, first we go down here. And with the stage effect, that's when you defeat Launch Octopus, there's water that rises up. And so, what you want to do... Yeah. Okay, what you want to do is dash jump, and since there's water, it'll be higher gravity, and I now I think that's the last hard tank of the game. Alright, now that that's out of the way, you want to dash jump right here. We have found a hidden passage over here, and we have to fight this mini boss. He's not really that hard, but I like to use Storm Eagle's weapon. You just can't. You have to aim for the head, and you can't miss. That's what- gosh shit. Yeah, that's basically the whole fight. He's just gonna try to grab you and jump across the stage. Uh. Ooh, shit lag. Maybe I fired that move at the wrong time. Oh, lag! Damn it, crowd's flying out. I thought we were friends. No! Okay. Son of a bitch. So whenever I'm, like, Reaching end game or getting far in the game, perhaps just have to be a dick. God damn it. Alright, well, time to mega bust the fuck out of this nigga. Wow. After that, the final upgrade. That's actually pretty nice. Really, perhaps? God damn it! But now we got the last. We got the armor piece. And we're pretty much invincible for the rest of the game. Come on. We're not invincible, invincible, but we'll live. 
Son of a bitch. That tank is... Down here? No. Wonder. Can I burn the trees? Down here? No. It's a factory man. Right armor! Oh shit! I guess after this I'm just gonna grind on energy. And I'm not on my below stage. But now, I'm gonna take on... Final Maverick. Alright, what's the thing Chameleon likes to do is jump up on the roof and the ceiling and then shake the whole room and turn invisible, move around. He like does his that attack and I think one more. I can't hit him. I think one more if he gets close to you, he's gonna shoot his tongue at you. Come on. Ah. Fuck you. No! Damn. Cool thing about the boomerang is that if you get it to return, it just fills up that bar. Booyah! In your face! Sorry about that. Now he's down for the count. Thank God. I don't know why I stood silent there, but oh well. Alright, now we're coming to Endgame. Alright, well, I think I have enough time to do Sigma 1.
Where is it? I actually gotta hate this segment. For some reason I always died here. Uh. Oh shit! Oh shit! No! Motherfucker. Alright, something got serious. It's like almost every episode I've died. It kinda blows. Fuck you! You don't want none of this beef. I'll fuck all y'all niggas up. Dash jump, god damn it! Oh, <laughs> let me dash jump. Ah! Oh god! Oh god! Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Right, I'll see if this will protect me. Yeah, what you got? What you got? Yeah. Yeah. Good. Ugh. Ah, uh, apparently I'm having some technical difficulties slash trouble, so I'll meet you at the top. Okay. All right. Now. Uh, okay. There. Now that I'm actually inside the castle. Uh, stage. Whatever. Where? How? How are we? Yeah. <sighs> like ever since part three I started dying a lot. And vile and then zero Hey, wait! That didn't sound too good. I can't really tell what's, like, what's Zero's position. Like, it looks like it just turned into bad design. Like, what the hell is that? Looks like they, like, re- like, mashed up his body. It looks like he's on one knee, I can't even tell. Oh no! After getting all our upgrades, all these weapons, can we do it? Can we do it? Can we defeat Vile? We can do it! Oh my god, I have so much face! We got this! We got this! Ah, come on! We can do it! We didn't spend all this time leveling up and doing all this stuff for nothing! Uh, yeah, it's another unwinnable fight. Zero! Zero, don't do it, man! Zero!
vile. He's uh, not so hard. He'll just try to absorb you. He'll fire his pellet into the air. Yeah, you better watch out for that little. Yeah, I forgot what he's weak against. I really forgot. You know, I'm just gonna stick to Mega Buster. Yeah, Mega Buster works fine. Damn it! Ha! Ah. Never! Yeah. All right. Oh no! I hope you die forever and never come back in future X games. Oh no, I think I gave a spoiler. Oh well. Zero! Dang, you actually look pretty fucked up there, buddy. Yeah, I sort of figured. Alright, well, I'll do the rest of this in part four. So, this is Mr. Renzo Kuzin, signing off. Leave a comment, please subscribe. See ya!